Welcome back to Just Scribble. I got home from work to a blue package and I am so excited because it is my B6 Slim Folio from Chic Sparrow that I have been waiting for and wishing for for such a long time and I decided I needed to do an immediate unboxing. I do have plans to do more detailed video on this folio and the size and the notebooks that fit but for right now I just really want to open it and see what it looks like and I wanted to do that with you all. So I'm just going to get straight to it, and then you can check back later for a second follow-up video. So I'm gonna open it up. Let's see if we got a sticker. We got our little card about the leather. I got another Spokane sticker. So cute. Ooh, and I got a feather sticker. I haven't gotten one of those in a very long time. Super excited. All right, this is the new B6 Slim Folio from Chic Sparrow. It launched on the 26th of February. Before launching, Jennifer Harvey did a poll to find out if we wanted them to be made in all the leathers, even though some of them would require a little bit more work and breaking in for them to close properly and to lay flat because they were firmer, less soft leathers. And we pretty much unanimously said yes. And I was so glad because that meant that I could order a Hemingway Havana in the B6 Slim Folio. I adore Havana. Bennett is my favorite Darcy or Austin leather uh, to date. And so I, I'm just super excited. So here is my folio. Oh gosh, I'm so excited. I've got scars and little bug bites. I love it. Look at the pull up on the spine, how light it is. I actually think that this will wrinkle if I rolled it just a little bit, which I might have to do just for the notebook to close properly and break in a little bit faster once I put my journal in it. Look at the inside. Look at the detail on the folding on the corners. And then this leather, is the same as this leather. This isn't the interior flesh. It's two pieces of leather laid together and then a third layer for the slip pocket for your notebook to go into. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, okay. I'm gonna grab my B6 Slim Nanami paper real quick just to stick it in there and then I'm gonna let y'all go and I'm gonna go play with my notebook. All right, so I have my B6 Slim Cafe note from Nanami paper and this is a lined version and I'm going to slide it in there when you first pick put it in there it does kind of take a little bit of shimmying because it is made to fit this notebook which means it is a very tight fit not a loose fit so that it is you know the perfect fit for it so it takes a little bit of maneuvering but once you get it in there, it's perfect. Oftentimes in my folios, I don't actually put them in both sides of the cover because sometimes I will add a second piece over, a second insert over here, or I will stick a dashboard in here to hold things, or I will use it to hold stickers or rulers or stencils and things like that. For right now, I am just going to leave it like this because I want to work on softening the leather and breaking it in. But it is awesome. Look how slim that is. Isn't it pretty? I'm so excited, guys. Okay, so I'm going to go work on my leather, break it in some, and I will be coming back and doing a second video for you guys going over more details about this folio, the size of it, how it compares to other notebooks and folios, and also some of the notebooks that you can put in it that fit and work in the new B6 Slim Folio from Chic Sparrow. I hope you liked this quick little unboxing. Make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss my follow-up video, and don't forget to just scribble.